Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Today, we're jumping into Modern Warfare and looking at the Notice Me 4 bundle. Now, this is one of the cheaper bundles that we're getting or have gotten, and understandably why, as we're only getting a variant of a sniper rifle. And of course, some good charms, calling cards, emblems, you know, all that great stuff. Now, of course, nobody can ever complain about the Notice Me bundles. I mean, wait, are we still in no sem September? Yes, we are. Okay. So again, today we're going to be using this. We're going to go ahead and purchase this. Beautiful, beautiful. Now, this gun is going to be the Rytec AMR Sniper. I have to say this is probably one of the worst attachments, the class setup that I've seen on a bundle. So I'm not going to kill myself by using this the Rytec is such a slow sniper and you can't be running this stuff you can't so this is what I'm going to be using let's get another close close up just just for YouTube purposes just just for y'all not not for me in any way no what I mean it's beautiful all right, we're going to jump into a free-for-all and hopefully go off in this video and show this off now, while we're finding a free-for-all match, as always, I'm going to be giving away at least one of these packs. Since it's cheaper, I'll probably at least give away two or three of them. Just make sure to comment down below what platform you're on and how I can contact you. Y'all didn't see anything that just happened behind the scenes, but let's just say that I got shafted in free-for-all, so now we're moving to Team Deathmatch, and we're not going to talk about it. All right, well, we're jumping into Azir Cave. Is that how you say it? I feel like I should know how to say it by now. It's fine. It's fine. Have a good look at this. Can never go wrong with some anime skins. Never. Now we just need to hope that we can hit some clips. Modern Warfare this whole year has been talking about how they want to stick to the more realistic type of everything in this game. And then they put out stuff like this that's just... It's not realistic. I mean, sure, you could wrap your gun in some kind of anime skin but no one's doing that correction no one in the military is doing that all right we're gonna jump around this corner yep there's one should be able to get another one nope because i'm trash at the game there we go I'm not a huge fan of the explosive bullets, but since that's what was on this, I decided to go with it anyways. The velocity just seems very slow, kind of throws everything off. But I mean, I guess it isn't terrible for that reason specifically. There we go. We're getting some kills now. This is when I usually die when I talk about getting kills. And the VTOL! Let's go! Alright, let's go ahead and throw this out. This is probably one of the worst maps for the VTOL. But then again, we just can stick in the cave as people swarm in. Alright, well, he does not want to die. Get the double kill. There we go. But I'm really hoping next year... Although that I like realism and all that good stuff, that they try and be a bit more creative. It seems like they were working on that as the year went along in Modern Warfare, but not enough. We need those reactive camos back, especially with the new consoles coming out. I pre-ordered both of them. I ended up giving away the Xbox Series X already, though. But everything is just going to look beautiful. Woo! Oh, God. That's fine. At least I got that one kill. Overall, it's a pretty cheap um, pack or bundle. It doesn't have much in it, which is why that it's cheap. Are we going to have people around here? Yes. Oh, yeah. My beautiful aim. Why do I hear someone? Why can't I find him? Oh, hi. Thank you. Woo! 
I have to say, I know, off topic, but sniping in uh, the new Call of Duty game, Cold War, also feels great. I know that they mentioned that they purposely made them more overpowered than they plan to in the future, just so that they can get uh, some data regarding it, which, I mean, it's a great time to test stuff out, of course, in Alpha. Alright, let's see if we can get at least uh, one or two more kills before this game ends. There's one. There's two. Okay. Okay. Three. Was this guy dead over here? I would assume that our teammates killed him. All right. Well, 22 kills. Not too shabby. We were at least able to show off this gun, which is all I wanted to do, even though that I'm not the best sniper. I apologize. But overall, a decent bundle. Nothing too fancy. Nothing out of the ordinary, really. Possibly something that I'll use in the future. Just throwing it on, because why not? Again, I definitely won't use the attachments that come with it. This makes the gun so extremely slow. I mean, you can go for it, but don't. Don't use it. Let me know what you guys think of this bundle. Do you think it's cool? Do you think it's a waste of money? Let me know. Again, I will be giving away a couple of these to some of my subscribers down in the comments. So make sure to tell me what platform you're on and how I can contact you. Anyways, as always, thank you guys for watching. I love you guys, I appreciate you guys, and I will see y'all in the next one.